my channel. So I wanted to make this video. Why should you even watch my YouTube channel, right? I know, still growing my subscribers, but what a lot of people don't know, and don't know this is not a video of me teaching you how to do nothing. I'm kind of multitasking right now because um, I have all these videos that I want to do, especially the one that I want to talk about, which is budgets and business budgets 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 if you know me i love love budgets like i love it i think it has a lot to do with business so it has a lot to do with saving and it has a lot to do with numbers and i'm actually not like a math person per se no like not at all but when it comes to budgets my math gets real creative but I wanted to make this quick video multitasking again because I had originally planned to launch a budgets and business budget like three course video but it's not ready yet those videos are not ready and I am not about to rush the videos um, and the content because I think it's going to be like amazing and I think that you guys will really 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 appreciate um, the information that I'm gonna give you all my friends, family, and people are always asking, even clients before I remember, like, how do you budget and how can you do it? And da, da, da. I love it. Like, I'm that spreadsheet girl slash coupon saver app slash um, I stockpiling slash doing it with reason. And doing it like, how can I say it? Um, I don't do it in a scarce amount. I don't do it like um, there's scarcity. Oh my God. I don't do it like that. Um, so definitely those are coming up so please stay tuned but i wanted to make this video um before you watch my other videos um about why you should watch this channel and why who am i by the way because a lot of you you might not know who i am so my name is alicia and i am actually a author speaker and entrepreneur as a matter of fact i was a business brander and fashion designer for many years actually i started in the fashion industry with fabula design so all my clients i love you um so business is my thing um but i did fabula designs for many many years and i love fashion and still till now i still love it you know my fashion clients call me up or tell me hey you know tell me a little bit about this or what do you think about this and i'm like don't do that do this da, 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 da. <laughs> so I come from a business of fashion background and um, I love business and that's that's exactly my upbringing as far as my professional career for that I started a long 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 time ago but it all had to do with marketing and business and international business and all that fun stuff to that's not fun for many people but for me it is and then and then life happens. I always say that because life happens. And it's like you're driving, right? And you're like, doo -doo -doo -doo, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day in the neighborhood. And you're like, hold up, what? A detour? <laughs> what? I'm going to be late. My life is not supposed to be in this detour. Uh, and that's what happens. So my life became, had a detour. And so many things happened. But with that... Um, I was able to travel the world and build great relationships and learn so much about a little bit of everything. And then another day came and I was like, I want to help people because there's something in with me that's my passion that I want to help people. And not helping people like, a, you know, a therapist or anything like, nothing like that. Just help people with my journey, just like you have your journey. And I believe that we all can help. So... I started the Dear God Are We There Yet movement. And for some of you that do not know what that is, the movement is start started off with the podcast and it also started off with a book. And it's about how life is a journey. It's a road trip. And we don't know where we're going. We don't know where we're heading, but we're always saying like, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Sidebar. I actually used to pray like that. Like, dear God, are we there yet? And God can be anyone you want it to be. So as you can see, I talk about that a lot, that God can actually be who you want it to be. It doesn't have to, it can be Allah, Jah, anyone really. Um, so it's just a metaphor. Oh, I think that was a screw. Hold on. <laughs> and I'm not editing this out because ain't nobody got time for that. So in a nutshell, I had all these ideas of how all the people that I met in the world and just in my journey, how I can help people. And it became this book. This first book was a, it's part of a series. And then 
the first book was like after I wrote it and I published it I was like I've already changed because that's what happens like I don't think that way anymore not that I think all of it but I'm not there anymore and so I realized that Dear God Are We There Yet is a movement it's a community filled of having conversations no matter what it is in your life we're always at a conversation we're always at a roadblock or we're always at a detour and having those conversations with people in your lives or meeting people or just talking to strangers like because we don't talk like it's 1995 and and by the way, the reason why I say 1995 is because, I mean, like, I was super young and we didn't have, like, text message. I didn't have a beeper. I didn't have, we didn't have internet like that. Um, I'm Dominican. We didn't have a computer. We had one TV in the whole house. Yes. Um, so, in 1995 is, like, where I can think of, like, I'm, like, in elementary literally and I'm having conversations like I remember me and my best friend like going to the you know the fence and like having conversations or friends and having conversations and writing little notes and whatever so to me I always say 1995 fast forward the movement the podcast the YouTube YouTube is about three series, budgets and business, as clearly you can see that you're going to get amazing things that I do, like literally I do and I've done. I won't promote anything that I do not like. I won't promote anything that I don't believe in. Um, I'm doing this just to grow the movement. And like I always say in all my videos, I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, because do we know what we're doing in life? Like we do know what we want to do. We know some of us know our purpose, but sometimes you still don't know. Even if you're doing it, you don't even know, right? So biz budgets and business is supposed to be that love for that budgets and the business aspects. For all my clients, my private clients that I used to have, or even people in business or entrepreneurs, that's the part of a love of mine that I love to help people. I love to be real with them and say, hey, you're not doing this, or did you hear about this, or why companies are not spreading this, or why are people not talking about this in fashion school or B school, right? Um, because they don't teach you certain things. So that series is specifically for budgets and business, where personal budget business budgets all kinds of stuff then I have the self growth series and as you can see in the self growth series it's everything that has to do with self growth things that can help us grow because we are not perfect I am NOT perfect I'm gonna say this right now you see this no makeup in a little boom boom right here and this is my workout stuff and I'm painting my vintage um oh yeah because you probably think like what 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 is this their background um this is my vintage um jewelry case that i had and i'm extra i love jewelry so um and my mom had well i had it a long time ago and i moved so much and i left it at my mom's and i want to um paint it so because i don't want to get rid of it but i want to do like that stone wash kind of thing this way i can keep all my jewelry because like i said i'm extra i love jewelry like i love jewelry like custom jewelry you know and I think it's the fashion inside of me. And so I'm actually doing this. And so I'm multitasking, as you can see. But I wanted to make this video just like I went ahead and made some vlogging uh, today and the other day or whatever um, to try to put that in. But let me get back on track. Self-growth. Self-growth series is exactly that. I'm not perfect. You're not perfect. I don't think anyone is perfect. And we don't want to be perfect. But there's this, there's this thing called growth. And what happens is no matter where you're at in your life, we can always improve and grow because what happens is it strengthens our relationships, it strengthens our lives, and it kind of makes us as ease. And you know, the pursuit of happiness is really about growth. It's nothing else. It's at this moment, are you happy? How can I grow? There's always room for growth. And so that series is particularly for self-growth which I love because I'm always I'm always curious like I don't like the word self help because that means I feel like then something's wrong with you and there's nothing wrong with you I mean no, there's nothing wrong with you. No matter what you think you are, if you're depressed, if you're sad, if you're angry, if you're emo, if you're um, zero to 100, or if you're extrovert, introvert, there's nothing wrong with you. But sometimes we feel there's something wrong with us. Sometimes we feel like we can't connect and we can't nobody understands us or whatever the case is but that starts with us and that's so hard because even me sometimes oh sometimes I'm like Lisa you gotta get it together why are you bickering about that or why are you doing that and again I'm not perfect 
let me be clear i am not perfect um i make lots of mistakes and this is why these series i i try to be as transparent and open um to a certain extent I ain't, you ain't gonna be all up in my life but you know what i mean um because I feel that that self growth, those tips that I've learned and that people have taught me or I've learned from other people, I wanna share with those. And of course, to get you prepared for book two, which is a little bit different than book one, um, series one, totally different, like like day and night different. And that's why I'm not rushing to put it out. And I wanna put like little snippets out through YouTube and the podcast to kinda of see what people like and not like and what people are just gravitating to. So that's the second one. And the third series on my YouTube channel is the empowering, you know, my passion to empower. Whenever I do speaking events, I, I which I love, I absolutely love um, because I'm able to take the energy from an audience and kind of interact with them. I, I don't believe in when I'm speaking, just, you know, just talking and memorizing. Mind you, I am horrible, horrible at memorizing anything. So if you ever hear me speak just like these YouTube channels and my podcast, I literally do not edit. I think I probably edit the beginning and the end so you know you don't hear that sound. But other than that, I don't edit. Like, I don't got time for it. This is who I am. And I will always say I speak backwards. Spanish is my first language and all that stuff because this is who I am. But my passion to empower is that deep down inside, there are so many different elements of empowering each other. And it can be empowering women, it can be empowering men, it can be empowering children, organizations, empowering, um, it can be empowering your day. It can start from your day, just like you and your day. Um, and I'm, I'm talking, but I'm gonna try to do this because this is multitasking. Um, but empowering your day and seeing how, you know, how fulfilled you could be within your day with within you um nothing nothing extra it doesn't have to be anything extravagant it can be your neighbor it can be your you know your gym buddy whatever the case is like that empowerment um you have no idea actually you probably do every time you open up a book or a magazine i don't know if you guys read but i love magazines and um you'll be surprised the stories of other people how empowering that is and so I think that is like, that is the, the, you know, you can change the world, you know, how you can change the world, be the change you want to see exactly as cliche as it sounds, being the, you know, the change that you want to see is empowering other people that it's okay. And, um, you know, everyone's opinions matters and we do not have to agree. Um, we can agree to disagree. And I guess this comes with my kumbaya or whatever the case is um because i can kind of be a little out there in a utopia as you can see with my my wife says this is a unicorn so i guess this is my unicorn you guys like my unicorn <laughs> anyways so this is my channel and i would love for you to um you know also check out the podcast which is every tuesday it's on itunes android and spotify i know i kept talking about that um where you will be able to hear other things within the dear god are we there yet movement so i wanted to make again this quick video i don't know if it's really quick and hope you stay till the last to the end um so that you can understand why I made this channel, what is the point of it. And uh, here's five things that you don't know about me. First, I love, 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 love to dance. <laughs> I love merengue, I love salsa, I love it. Two, I love ice cream, like oh my god. Three, I love my family, I love my wife, I love my family. Um, I'm very, very close, that that's the Spanish side in me. I speak to my mom and dad almost every day. Hello, I don't know if you're Dominican and you don't do that or maybe it's the other way around. So I love family time. I love spending time with um, not only my family or my wife, but like loved ones, uh, friends. Um, I love that one on one. So that's something really, really important to me. And four, oh my God, did I already say I like ice cream? No, no. I like ice cream and, and rice. That's a weird combination, but that's that one. Um, oh, travel. Number four, I love to travel. I think that sparks energy and inspiration and creativity. And I think it does for anyone, you know? I think you get to see life a little bit different. Um, 
and I have there's a lot more than five things that I love um and by the way family means my dog as well Betsy she is basically family like she is family so what else what else what else what else oh and um the fifth one I would say because I have so much but I have to leave the fifth one is I love helping um I love helping people I love being there for people I love to make people smile um even if it's a joke or me acting crazy when my 50 you know impressions or whatever I love just to be I love that like I just I I I love it. I love to make people smile and happy and just, yeah. But I have a lot more things. So as you watch this channel, you'll see all the other things that I love um, and, and what I relate to and talk about. So thank you again for watching. I'm going to go back to my painting. And next week, well, I'm not even going to say next week. I'm going to say upcoming. In the upcoming weeks, you are going to see, oh, my unicorn is looking. <laughs> you are going to see the budget videos. And honestly, if you don't have a budget right now, you are going to want to watch these videos. And these videos are going to come with free worksheets. Yes, you don't have to pay nothing. They're going to come with free worksheets that you can download, literally like a Google Doc or Excel, and you can keep it yourself. And if it's too much, you can even send it to your phone. That's why I'm not rushing to put it out. But you are going to love the Budgets and Business budget ser series that's going to come in. I mean, the series is already out, but these videos are going to come. And it's going to be a series of many videos, maybe like three or four. Um, they're not finished because I want them to be perfect. But honestly, if I can leave you with anything in this video, have a budget for 2000 for life, for, 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 for your being, for yourself. Um, it's so empowerful and it's, it's so empowering and so powerful to be able to have control over that. Um, so for many of you who have dreams and aspirations of doing things or going places or whatever the case is, the money portion in this world, in this now is, it's important. And so if you have family, if you want to have kids, if you have kids, there's a lot of resources online. Trust me. But the nuggets I'm going to give you or the little tools or the little seeds I'm going to give you are going to be super easy and they're all free because it's free. You just got to watch my video. All right, you guys, have a good one and I will see you next week.